we are making some coconut run down this morning have the coconut milk coconut we already broke one and here it is boiling down so let's get in there and this is the selfish so some selfish run down the coconut is halfway through and as you can see the oil is sort of separating from the milk and that's what we're looking for so we're gonna let that boil down a little more and here is the selfish I'm just boiling it off one more time for like 10 minutes over here we have our veg we have our scallion some tomato thyme this this is very important for this recipe ginger because some people them stomach can't manage the the milk the coconut milk so you're gonna combine the ginger and the garlic together this is some hot pepper and here we have the onion and some bell pepper sweet pepper for this recipe guys you're not supposed to use any oil so no vegetable oil olive oil nothing the coconut milk this is what we're gonna use only so that's why we're waiting for it to boil down until it gets oily and it's have to boil good because it would burn your stomach coconut when you cook coconut you have to make it boil down good so guys this is when you know that the coconut is ready when it started like this you know for sure that this oil is in the pot the natural oil from the coconut this right here is perfect guys as i was saying earlier a lot of people stomach can't really take the coconut so we're gonna add the ginger and the garlic come yeah back. we're adding the onions to the pot then we're gonna add the bell peppers and you could use whatever bell peppers you want whatever color i just i had yellow and red so that's what i'm using i'm gonna add the add pepper next i don't really like pepper but it gives flavor then the scallion and tomato is optional i like tomato so i'm adding tomato Guys, we're gonna go ahead and add some vinegar, not enough. We don't want too much. Then we're gonna add our sausage. Make sure so you take out the bones out of your sausage. Then I'm gonna go ahead and put pepper. I'm gonna light one of black pepper. And I'm gonna go ahead and add some all purpose for flavor. You could add any type of season you like. Me just I use some muggy all purpose and you don't want too much because you don't want it overpower um all of your ingredients so you have there you have it guys put in your time your dry time fresh time whatever time you have me have fresh time give it a mix then we're gonna cover it for like two to three minutes and it should be good Hey y'all, so this is the final result of my saltfish rundown. I didn't put the in the, the, the pot with the rundown because that's not how I like it. My mom likes it that way, but I'm good. This is the final product and thank you guys so much.